More than 650 homes in Wayne County damaged by flooding may not have federal relief coming to help with repairs. 7 Action News reporter Brian Abel is in Taylor with what this means for people impacted. The last time I was standing at this Taylor intersection was May 1st. Rain had fallen more than three inches worth and water was right about up to here. Cars were floating around me. The governor making a request for a federal disaster declaration, one that we found out today was denied. The city infrastructure just simply cannot take that much. This was just some of the significant flooding in Wayne County over a three day period roughly four months ago. Governor Whitmer would request federal assistance from FEMA for people affected like Alicia Schlitz. I can't even tell you what's down there. I have a lot of family memorabilia. Today we're learning that federal help denied. If this were approved, that doesn't mean necessarily that uh, everybody in Wayne County receives FEMA assistance. Even if you did qualify for the assistance, the amount of assistance you get is only to return your home to a pre-disaster condition. George tells 7 Action News that without FEMA's help, roughly 655 homes impacted by the floods are nearly out of options for financial aid. Paul Pringle, who hopped in a kayak to help others get out during the flooding today, reacting to the federal denial. Yeah, it's more the people with the with the basements I feel most for. You know, luckily I live on a slab. No water got down in the basement. We were able to replace some flooring and be done. Governor Whitmer has already appealed this decision. The state says that if this denial remains in place, they will look for other federal aid options. For 7 Action News, I'm Brian Abel. Just so